people, welcome to our home. Not welcome to the madhouse. Hello guys and welcome to today's video. I am cradling two very naughty puppies at the moment who are insisting on being in today's video. So, if they're not too naughty they can stay up here but they are misbehaving a little bit. Anyway, I wanted to do this video for so long now. I've been tweeting, Instagramming, telling you some sneaky peeks about what is going on and basically You'll have noticed from behind me, I have officially moved house. The puppies are naughty, so they're on the floor now with a chew. Okay, so there have been so many questions about why I'm moving, where I'm moving to, etc. And I wanted to do this video to explain a little bit about it and to tell you guys what's happening and a bit of an update. So basically, as you know, I was in the cottage with my sister and I absolutely love that cottage to bits and I was so, so upset to be leaving the cottage. The situation that we were in, first of all, I am still living with my sister. So it's just me and Holly and we've moved together and we're still living together. So loads of you were like, no, you're separated. But don't worry, we literally are gonna be living together until we're all grannies. If you're not already subscribed to Holly, she has a YouTube channel called Holly Sheeran, so I'm gonna link that below because she is literally my favorite person in the world. We do so much together and she's here with me in my house. So it will be so fun if you subscribe to her channel and then you you can see all of her videos as well and I'm in a load of those. We were in a kind of two up two down house with two of us in separate rooms and then two dogs and we were getting to the point where the dogs didn't have anywhere to go. There was a shared garden but main roads all around us, there was a dual carriageway and the dogs just didn't have any room to run around and as they started to get bigger and bigger I just felt so bad for them because they didn't have the room that I wanted them to have. It just wasn't fair on them. And we got to the point where I wanted them to be able to just open a back door and run into the garden outside and have that life that was better for them. And there were a couple of other reasons as well. So me and my sister are working a lot more from home now because of what we do and we're based at home and we needed a spare room to be able to film in. And also if we had people over to stay, we had nowhere for anyone to stay. So we had our cameras and all the filming equipment and everything you need to do YouTube, which I know I've talked about to you guys because lots of you guys do it at home too. So the lighting and everything else. And we just were at full capacity at the cottage and what was my forever home turned into a kind of, we didn't have enough room, the puppies were just wanting to be outside and there was nowhere for them to go and we needed a bit of space to just breathe with two of us living together and also Holly and I wanted to live together for quite a long time more so if one of us gets a partner or anything else happens we wanted a spare room where we've got a little bit more space but it came about and we found somewhere that's five minutes up the road from where we were before. So I'm still right next to my mum and I'm still living in Nottingham. When we first let them into the garden, the look on their faces just running around was so worth it because they had the space to just be dogs and do everything that dogs do outside and the quality of their life is gonna be so much better now and I think it was nice for me and Holly to be able to have a garden as well and just be able to sit outside. The other part of this video, basically, I need your guys' help. So obviously there is loads of interior to do now. So please write down right now any inspiration that you have for interior, we are going to be doing a lounge, a kitchen and bedrooms and an office. So I would love for you guys to send me on social media, whether it's Twitter or Instagram or comment now, what ideas, like what themes, have you seen anything that you love, colour schemes or anything because with the cottage it was very shabby chic and this is kind of similar so it is a bit shabby chic but I'm really open to ideas so I would love to know what you guys would like to see inside my house and then the other thing as well is what would you like me to film so I want to do some room tours because I want you guys to see the house but I want to do something a little bit different so I do want to do that the whole lounge tour and bedroom tour but I'd quite like to do some different things. So write down if you would like to see some DIY home videos. So I'm so excited. And also it's a little bit of a fresh start for Holly and I. Last year was obviously very difficult with a lot of bad memories. And so we wanted this year to be a fresh start with new memories and a new home and just 
kind of a new start for everything. So the puppies and us and just making new memories in a new place that are going to be super happy. So I hope you guys are happy. And I went to BeautyCon and I posted a get ready with me which shows you how I got ready when I got to meet so many of you guys at BeautyCon which was so fun. So click now and that's going to take you right through. And B, come here. You've arrived just in time to say bye bye. Bye bye everyone, we're in a new home. Bye bye everyone, we're in a new home. Woo! No, you're not excited, are you? Not until you're in the garden. Bye guys!